Hello and welcome to Dude Engineer. Today we're gonna make a cube for Big Diamond Break Bomber. As you can see, I printed a paper. Uh, the link is in the de uh, description. So check out, go and download and print it. So after you printed the paper, you can cut it off, use some scissors, and try not to shake a lot so it doesn't make it worse so try and make it straight as you can see I'm cutting it and after you've done it you should be left with a shape such as a T shape and then you're just gonna place it on the cardboard just do it on the hard cardboard so it's thick try to find a cardboard which is thick and then place it on top of it at this stage you might have to see what the edge is right at the edge so you don't waste a lot of cardboard and then you just gotta glue it in use some glue i'm just i'm using a pva glue that's a really good glue to use and then you just gotta stick it on top the reason why i'm doing it at the edge so if you do it in the middle you're gonna waste the border of the cardboard which is really bad so that's what i'm gonna do at the edge so after you've done it just try to swipe in Try to get it really, really stick it and then wait about two minutes if depending on the glue you're using obviously and then as I can as you can see after I'm doing it just keep doing it and then do it with your hand and then you can wash your hands after you've done it two minutes just gotta cut it off again now the cardboard at this stage you have to be pretty careful because you want to do it really really good like if there is any mistakes in this stage the whole process is ruined so try to make it as perfect as you possibly could after a little slight mistake and uh, you will see how bad that is okay so once you did it you'll i'll show you how to do it so how to do a cube if someone doesn't know how to do a cube so by the border as you can see the line you just gotta fold it in Yep, that's it. Fold it in. You gotta do it for all the lines that I have. That should do it, yes. And then the second line, and then the third line, and the fourth line, as you can see. So, as we progress to do it, try to do it as perfect as you could, you know. If you don't try not to do it, okay. I'll, sh I'll do this again with you. Yeah, and then that should make a cube shape and then we're just gonna use a tape but not yet because this is just a demo we're just gonna show you how it's done that's about it and then we just lay it flat okay I'll just lay it flat for now you didn't have to do that step just just in case if you didn't know just take another cardboard now and a cardboard that's really thin so it's easier to cut and then because if you're using thick cardboard it's difficult to cut as you can see, and you're gonna make 25 of these cubes for the stadium we're making. So as I can see, you can do any box. If you if you don't have a box that is flat on flat, you have to do what I'm doing right now. Just get there carefully, try not to tear it apart because that's really a big disaster. So yeah, once you have done that, just gonna lay it on flat on top. And then you can take your shape and place it on top of that cardboard and make draw draw lines all over it and then do it keep it being done you should find yourself doing like that well i made the shapes so it's easy to distinguish between them because it's say it's a cube we might get lost making cube right so use a shape that's a, just keep a shape for each cube as, as you can see and then it's easy to to make the difference between them that's it once you've done it you just cut it off cut all the things and shape the t-shapes and yeah then you should find a but well, I've made 15 of them and then I'll make another because that's what the capacity of this box it would be the amount of the amount I could make was 15 from the well me myself I was left with 15 so now I will just use a different box the box I've used 
is a tissue box as you can see tissue box well a tissue box you can, i've used that because it's a tin it's nice good okay you can use if you yeah so if you do have to do this if if you if the box you've used last time you can make 25 of them that's fine you don't have to use another box but if you kind of get less of them you have to use another box you know just have to tissue box is a really good box because as you can see it's 10 gets the job done the same process we're just gonna tear apart make it flat on the desk the table you're gonna place the whack as you can see from the earlier because you don't want to use the last one and then once you've done it you should obviously the last three are the same thing and I'm just gonna cut it down this is what you should be left with a lot of teas okay. and then yeah let's show let's make a cube properly now and then just gonna fold it as I shown before just fold it this but the difference between now is we're gonna tape it down so I'm gonna use some tape I'll show you how much to use use a tape transparent tape you can use a masking tape if you want use a white masking tape if you want if you're let's say you have different color as you can see my tissue box had flowers on it I could use masking tape on top of it that's gonna hide it so you just want to take some tape that amount is all right so five centimeters probably you know if you guys really wanted to do five centimeters should be fine and then just want to place one of the pins right there the top of the T top right of the T and then just gonna fold it fold the cube and then just put a plate put the tape on top of that cube right there as you can see it's a bit imperfect it doesn't matter if it looks like a cube it's fine it might be slightly off that's totally all right that's, this is your first time it's fine so we'll be left with a be where you're gonna do another tape okay you could use some more tape so that's fine just gonna use another tape and then just use tape just do a lot for this one because it's tiny it's not a lot so yeah it just plays in the remaining edge put it peep place it on top of it and yeah you should just nicely go on it so now that's done you made a cube great now you can do 25 of them i'll just make a few video okay so at this point of the video i'm just going to tell you break bomber BDM Stadium, it's great. You can play with your partner. If you have a BDM, great. You know that's why we're making this video. Right? This is a part one, as you can see in the in the title of the video. It's part one. It's gonna be part two, part three. Well, I'm gonna make videos in each week. So this is first week, and then I'll do it next week. Upload another one, then I'll upload another one, and I will show you how the stadium works. So yeah, that's that. Well, after you finished them, finished all 25, 20, 20 of them, let's say 20 of them, the remaining 20, well, remaining 5 of them, you're going to do it differently, slightly differently. If you've seen the Brick Bomber Stadium, uh, on the top of them, you have red colors and then normal colors. So you can do any color if you want. You can do color it. I didn't do it because I was like, nope just couldn't do it i don't like colors so that's kind of true but i will i will try to do the colors of it you can do the colors i'll do some shapes on top of it and then just stick the clip that just saved some time just to save some time you know that's my excuse anyway you kind of made it beautiful beautiful same thing gotta use the tape same process cube you got the drill just making cube fine let's go right just a cube well yeah so the last bit as you can see you can make you have to make five of this so i made a different shapes as like you see i just need these lines and then i made those lines and i made another one of them 
four more, which is a triangle. Another I couldn't remember any shapes. And then a hexagon, I believe. And then a crawl, troll. Yes, and that's about it. Well, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Peace. Have a good day.